Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, I'm Chantel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a fall try on haul from H&M and I ordered these items about a month ago but they were really delayed but I'm going to go ahead and try them all on and see how they fit. So today I'm going to be showing you guys nine different pieces from H&M. I have a few jackets, a skirt, a pair of jeans, some dresses, you know, a little bit of everything. I haven't shopped at H&M in years, mostly because of their past scandals and I just wasn't having it. So I finally decided to give them another shot and do a haul. I'm really curious to see how these jeans fit, so I think I'm going to start off with these. and. Just to pair it with something, I'm going to pair it with this blouse. I think this is really cute. I really didn't remember ever buying this. I feel like I've never seen this shirt in my life, but here it is, and I'm going to try these on together. I'm obsessed with these jeans. I got them in a US size 4. They fit perfectly. There's no little gap at the back. It's a little bit big, but it's big in a way where if I add a belt, it would be perfect. I don't know, the top just really isn't me. The top is not buttoned, but this is how it looks from the back. It has this cute little bow, which I really love the details. And I am a fan of puff sleeves, but something about the top altogether, I don't really 100% love it. I don't know, let me know in the comments down below what you think of this top, because I feel like it's definitely very fashion forward, but I also feel like I look stupid, like a hospital patient, you know, the little robe you wear. <laughs> but the jeans are everything. So the next item that I'm going to be trying is this faux leather dress. I got it in a size extra small. It just has this little wrap belt. It looks a little bit oversized. I think it was meant to be oversized. So I'm going to pop this on and see how it looks. Here is the faux leather dress. I... I feel like I don't know what it is about it, but it doesn't suit me. I really don't know what it is because I see people wear these dresses all the time and they always look so good in them but for some reason I kind of look strange and I tried to open the top a little bit so I don't look so choked up but it doesn't really stay open. It almost looks like a black rain jacket on me. You know that weird faux leather smell? It has that which I really don't like but it does go away in time so it's not something you really have to worry about. Oh and another thing, it has this little, this cut right here which I'm really not a fan of. By the way, sorry if the light changes a bit. It's getting a bit dark outside. Next, I'm going to be trying on this cute little white cardigan. I got this in a size extra small. Why would I do that? Oh, I think this one was sold out in larger sizes. I did originally plan to get it in a medium, but they were all sold out. So I got it in an extra small. And I'm also going to just try it on with this black leather skirt and I got it in a size zero. And the reason I got it in such a small size is because I really like skirts to hug my waist. And it has this little slit here, super cute. So I've been looking to buy a nice cardigan for some time now and I really like this one. The color is really nice, it's super soft and very stretchy. So I'm really happy with this cardigan. I'll just show you the back. It's just a normal little cardigan and I will show you the skirt as well. So the skirt fits perfectly. I actually really love it. The um, slit comes up pretty high, but it's not the type of skirt that rides up so you don't have to worry about it accidentally, you know, doing some crazy stuff. And it has a little zip at the back and it has a button too so you can secure it. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and throw this on and try this shirt on with the skirt. So I have the shirt on and one reason that I bought it besides the fact that I love the color is it has a really high neckline and I don't really like shirts where the neckline comes down too low. I like it to be really high, so that was definitely a plus. I got it in an extra small, I think because it was sold out in other sizes and it's very, very tight. Now I have this pink corduroy shirt and I'm gonna be wearing it as a jacket, like that's how I plan to wear it. I've wanted one of these for so long. There was one I was gonna buy from Pretty Little Thing, one I was debating buying from Fashion Nova, but I found it at H&M and I got it in a size medium just so that it could be a little bit more oversized. So I'm just gonna throw this on. So I would not, I repeat, I would not wear this as an outfit. I wouldn't wear this all together, but I just wanted to quickly show you what it looks like on. So it's actually very thin and I would just wear it over maybe a white t-shirt and some jeans or 
leggings and a top. I think it's just a really nice over piece, especially for fall, and I really love the color. So the next item I'm trying on is this sweater. It's just a chunky sweater, and I feel like it's something you could throw on with anything. Leggings, jeans, it's very long, and it's very warm. It really gives me like a boho chic vibe, and I've just tried it on with these jeans for reference. It's just a nice everyday go-to sweater and if you like, you can always tuck the front into your jeans. Loose fitting jeans would obviously work best for that style. So the last piece that I will be trying is just this olive green dress and it's just a little, not mini, but also not midi dress. Just a basic dress that you can either dress up or down. You could wear it with running shoes or you could throw a pair of heels on and make it really fancy. You could also just throw a leather jacket over it or you could wear it as is. This dress is very versatile and I really love this color for fall. I have other dresses in this style. I really do like it. Alright guys, and that concludes my haul. I pretty much loved everything other than the white shirt that I tried in the beginning and this little number right here. <laughs> but everything else was great. So thank you so much for watching and I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye guys.